Hey, what's up everybody? Peter here back with you. Uh, standing on the bridge over the Gore Creek right here in Vail, Colorado. And pathway, food and cooking, a pathway to becoming a chef is my Facebook group. And Peter C. Brenner, CEC, yeah, that's my professional uh, page, my, my, uh, my business page. And I just wanted to do a follow-up uh, on the, my last talk about the restaurant that I owned and the challenges uh, making money in the food service industry. Uh, I just, you know, so I started the restaurant in 1991 and it literally took 36 months of losing money before we actually showed any profit. So I was in my 37th month and we finally showed a small profit on the balance sheet. And that was the point where we turned the corner. We actually went on after that for the next four and a half years and showed a small profit every month for like four and a half years. It, it was, you know, it was a good thing, but uh, the reality of it was the profit never grew to become enough to really cover all the expenditures that continually go on with a restaurant. And if you've, you've worked in restaurants, you know what I'm talking about. The cooler breaks down, uh, the food goes bad. Um, you didn't get, uh, you know, all kinds of different things come up when, you know, you gotta repair the building, the roof, you gotta fix the roof. Uh, you gotta paint the building, you got, uh, advertising it just it's one thing after another expenditures just never stop coming when you own a restaurant and uh, you know and a lot all businesses are like that um, you know I don't care what kind of small business you're in expenses just eat you alive and uh, you know it it was it, for me it was a great lifestyle at the time I didn't need a lot of money I was young I was in my 30s and I wasn't really thinking about money and, and what my life was gonna look like, you know, 20 years down the line when I was in my 50s and 60s like I am now. But, uh, you know, I survived it, uh, closed it up, ended up with a bunch of debt. I was able to, you know, eventually pay my debt off. I didn't file bankruptcy or anything like that. Um, I paid my debts off. And it worked out for me. I went back to work in the hotel industry and um, got a decent job. And, you know, because of that, I was able to buy a house that I'm still in now. And, you know, that has helped stabilize my financial situation for me. Um, but anyway, you know, like I was saying in the, the video that I did prior to this one, before this one, um, you know, I've always had to have second jobs to make ends meet and I'm still doing that with Uber and uh, you know now I'm working on this affiliate marketing business and a knowledge based business so you know the one of the things you always have to remember when you're when you're trying to start a business is stick with it don't give up it's so easy to give up um, because th times get tough and you're like you get frustrated and depressed about it so, you know, just a word, uh, you know, from experience, my experience is, you know, just persevere and stick with what you're trying to get accomplished and you, you eventually you'll be a success, you know. So that's all I have for you today. Thanks for being out there and um, I will see you in the near future. So have a great day. Bye bye.